Now, one of the biggest questions I get frequently asked about the relevance of my content to individual people's situations is what species I work with or what species you'll see in my content. And the answer is all of them because positive reinforcement works for all species. The techniques and information that you will find on animaltrainingacademy.com are relevant for your species, for a dog or cat, at home or in a zoo. Let's look at three examples. These are station training, target training, and voluntarily placing oneself inside a crate and slash or space where an animal can be transported. Three behaviors that are essential to train with all animals. Firstly, we will start with station training. Station training is where our animals place their bodies in a particular location or station in order to earn positive reinforcement. This is particularly useful when we have to communicate to our animals where they need to locate themselves within their environments. We need to give them something to do whilst we are busy within their environments, or they need to wait until we are ready to engage. Target training is where we teach an animal to touch or place a body part to a particular object or location. For example, one of the most common types of targeting you will see is people training their animal to follow a target stick. <laughs> yeah. wow. How cool is that? Pretty cool. Allowing our animals to learn that voluntarily placing themselves in places such as crates, where we can then move them from location A to location B, is another foundational behaviour for me that is beneficial for all species to learn. So to summarize all of that information and to answer the question about what species my content is relevant for is that it works with all of them. As we just saw with 16 completely unique species and station training, target training and voluntarily entering into crates or spaces to be transported has universal application. I'm going to combine what you just learned with all the ingredients you need for success with the recipe for successful behavior management of animals in your care. The recipe being an acronym for reinforcement, environment, communication, information, partnerships, and empowerment.